Hello everyone. Today we are going to learn about tolerance reagent and and failing solution or agent, right? At first we learn the definition of tolerance reagent and then we will learn about the definition of failing solution right or reagent so let me say you what is a tolerance reagent right here you see diamine right diamine silver hydroxide is called tolerance reagent or it is the formula of tolerance tolerance reagent right in if I want to tell you in details, then I have to say tolerance reagent is a colorless solution of silver nitrate, right? Mixed with excess ammonium hydroxide. It contains diamine silver ion. This is right. This is so I will give you the link. Uh, of a specific video on tolerance reagent you can uh, view that video to get more idea here I want to say you that tolerance reagent uh, diamines silver hydroxide is called tolerance reagent right so now our target is how to distinguish between aldehyde and ketone well here this is methanol and this is ethanol right well this is a test tube right this is a test tube and if you add here 2 to 3 ml uh, tolerance reagent right tolerance reagent then if you add here 5 to 6 drop aldehyde aldehyde like uh, like methanol right ch3 cho like methanol and if you heat this mixture uh, two to three minutes right then you will see you will see a silver mirror is formed on the inner wall of the test tube right then you, then presence of aldehyde is confirmed that is methanol so here methanol is oxidized by tolerance reagent here the charge of silver here the charge of silver is plus one right here but here the uh, oxidation state of silver is zero so plus one to zero that means here silver is gaining electron right so and this electron is coming from methanol that is uh, methanol is a reducing agent and tolerance reagent is a oxidizing agent here and methanol will be converted into ammonium methanoate well however in case of ethanol we are getting ethanoic ammonium methanoate and silver mirror so the presence of silver mirror confirm the presence of aldehyde right I hope you have understood you can read this uh, line well remember ketone doesn't give this silver mirror test that is ketone does not uh, react with tolerance reagent so by this reaction you can differentiate between aldehydes and ketone right failing solution what is failing solution well failing solution failing solution is a blue solution right formed by the mixing equal volumes of copper sulfate solution and alkaline solution of sodium potassium tartarate solution that is failing solution uh, is the solution of sodium potassium tartarate and copper sulfate in basic uh, with base like sodium hydroxide right 
कपार सालफेट प्लस सोडियम पटाशियम टार्टारेट प्लस सोडियम हाइड्रोक्साइड दिस इज द फेलिंग सल्यूशन इन फेलिंग सल्यूशन उ we get uh, some dissolved copper 2 plus ion that is that act as a oxidizing agent so in a test tube right in a test tube if you add aldehyde like methanol and if if you add uh, 5 to 6 of ethanol in a test tube and if you add their 2 to 3 mi millimeter failing solution then you will see a red precipitate of copper oxide this is the proman this is the uh, proof of of the presence of aldehyde right so here is here is a two example here are two examples one is methanol another is ethanol methanol in presence of failing solution it is giving copper oxide precipitate and sodium methanoate and in case of ethanol it is producing sodium ethanoate and copper oxide precipit precipitation so but ketones doesn't give this failing solution test so by this test you can differentiate between aldehyde and ketone okay pause this video and read this uh, text and also check the description box of this video to learn about uh, to learn more about failing solution thank you for viewing this video be well